Joe Casey coming out and hitting the ring. Everybody knows that I'm supposed to have a Falls Town Anywhere match. Guess what? That idiot that tried to get him out before decided to fight me all over this building last time I was here. So I'm not going to wait. Joey Ace, I want you right now. Starting to show off. Quick here, witching hour. Come on! I know you're here somewhere. Joe Casey calling out Joey Ace right now. Here comes AJ Pan. Wait a minute from behind! Joey Ace! Attacking Joe Casey. False count anywhere match underway here. Craig Prendergast called for, for the bell. My good friend and partner, Brady Hicks. We turn that all about. Oh man, what a barn burner already right from the bat. False count anywhere match. Starting off witching hour here in Newcastle, Delaware. I cannot believe the aggressiveness. With which this show is starting, Phil. I'll tell you what, if you wasn't here last month at the anniversary show, these two guys tore the house down. Send them into the ropes and a back body drop. But this is not about a wrestling match. This is about a fight here tonight. And Joe Gacy. Right to the floor. Fight. That's right, right to the floor. Joey Ace. Craig Prentagas making his way to the floor. Security's coming out. Gacy chases him to the outside, going to continue the assault. And of course, it's all about the Mid-Atlantic title, but tonight, it feels more like it's about revenge. You know, it's about vengeance, just cold-blooded vengeance. Witching hour, Phil, just think about it, witching hour. No! Oh, no! <laughs> Talk about ringing Joey Ace's bell. Tell you what, I hope they don't come over here, Brady. Yeah, I hope not. We have the big expensive equipment here. Ace. We've, uh, Joey Ace, of course, coming to the ECWA several months, <coughs> several months back and going, going after our Mid Atlantic champion. I'm okay. Joey Ace is a, a, almost like. The hired mercenary bulldog of the PCA. Right now, they're going to the men's bathroom here at the United at the Asbury United Methodist Church. Unbelievable security following them in. Our cameraman right there with them. You're not going to follow him in with a mic. <laughs> Somebody's getting a swirly. Not fan. me. I'm not going in there. That's why we got Richard Ruiz, the main man, in there alongside him. Thank God I wasn't in the stall when this happened. <laughs> I'll tell you, an hour ago, if they would have brawled in there, they would have bumped into me. <laughs> and it looks like AJ Pan a little reluctant to get in there, get it, get knee deep in the action, I guess you'd say. Casey now chasing AJ Pan back to the ring. And where's Joey Ace? Looking to flush the ECWA of Joey Ace, and uh, wow, we have the most amazing fans, Phil. <laughs> I wonder what referee Craig Prennigas is thinking. This is where we need Dave Spieler, because he can go in the bathroom and get the dirt. Oh, here we come back out now. Hopping fresh, running for cover like it's a Japanese monster movie. <laughs> And in a lot of ways, it is. Joe Gacy, not unlike Godzilla or Mothra. You're right. I think uh, Craig Prendergast has his hands full with this one. Well, he's used to being in a bathroom, a drunk. Now, we've seen Joey Ace obviously take it to Joe Gacy on numerous occasions. Joe, of course, so frustrated by the attacks. Gacy now looking for weapons, bringing chairs in the ring. 
looking for anything. It's not looking like it's going to end well, that's for sure. Where the hell did he get a rug? An homage to Aladdin coming out in 2019. And Joey Ace going to cut him off with the chair. Joey Ace trying to ram Joe Gacy's head face first into that chair. Whoa! Gacy blocks it and in goes Joey Ace. Oh, this is not going to be good. Ducks the kick. Not so fortunate with the second one is Joey Ace. Casey going to pull the wool over his eyes. <laughs> Casey oh, no. Buried him under that rug. Pound on top of him. Joey Ace left utterly defense as collapses to the outside. And that is where we are, ladies and gentlemen. AJ Pan doesn't know what to do. Craig Prendergast doesn't know what to do. Uh, certainly Joey Ace doesn't know what to do. He's able to drop Gacy's throat over that rope. Gacy cutting him off at the mid at the midsection. Why am I coughing? I didn't cough all day, Phil. A cover for the first time. Joe Gacy, of course, the Mid-Atlantic champion since defeating Chris Wilde on the night that he was injured in Atlantic City several months back. Oh, oh, no, no. Coming our way. oh no, not against the wall, no! Oh, oh. Right against that hard painted wall. Craig go for a cover now on the floor. And of course, because it's reaching our mid-Atlantic title, it is falls count anywhere. We want Gino to get smacked. I do too. I agree with that champ. <laughs> And the PCA member just punishing oh. Joe Gacy. Well, I don't know what he hit him with there. I don't know if that was the ring bell, the hammer. Right now, Joey Ace, I think he's going for a cover on Gacy, a two count. AJ Pan furious with Craig Prenegas. Both men back to their feet, but where does it go from here? They have been absolutely punishing each other since Joe Gacy laid down the ultimatum to kick off the show. He could break his back, Phil. And you think it's funny? No, I was laughing at Craig Brennan. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Casey now blocking the suplex. Oh no, if he puts it through the chairs, it's gonna be over. Oh! oh, Casey ripped in half by the folding chairs. It looks like all three are broken. Twice possibly the Mid Atlantic champions back and a cover too. But only a toe count somehow, Joe Casey. Two and a half. Somehow. Casey. Somehow, Joe Gacy survives. Joe Gacy's been through more punishment and pain than that. He's got to put a lot to put him down. Well, you are right about that. But I thought for sure that he was a done for. And the Mid-Atlantic title returning to the PCA after a lengthy absence. Beautiful drop kick there by Joey Ace. Pinpoint right on the nose. And Ace, he's going to drag him to the corner. What does Joey have in mind? Missing the second row moonsault. Clubs on the moonsault as the five star stud. Oh, huge thunder power bomb. And that is going to get some hell. Some way, Joey Ace takes out. And Planet Terror Zone, Joe Gacy. Not sure where to turn, not sure what to do. A 
Blocks the suplex. Gonna whip him into the ropes. Look at that, a little razzle dazzle. Oh, into the cutter. But Ace, look at that wisely. Wow. Might not even know it, but he rolled to the outside. But of course, because it's false count anywhere, Joe Gacy can follow. Both men on the floor. Cutter gas. One, two. I love how violently Craig Prendergast hits the uh, floor. Casey now looking for a pal driver or something. Oh, look at this now. If he hits this, Phil. No, AJ Pan! You gotta be kidding me. And no disqualification, so anything. Oh, Casey into the. Unbelievable! He AJ just, Pan will do anything to help his men win. He just pushed Joe Gacy into the ring post. Joey Ace now. Trying to climb back inside the ring. It seems to have galvanized the five-star stud as he goes top rope. If he hits this fill, it will be over. Huge elbow. The bottle on our table shot him from it. New champion here. AJ Penn ramming Joe Gacy outside, right into the ring post, knocking Joe Gacy loopy. Joey Ace off the top rope, huge elbow smash, wins the title. The fans here are in a frenzy. They cannot believe that Joe Gacy lost the Mid-Atlantic Championship. What a fight. PCA once again trying to claim all the gold here in ECWA. And what a way to start it off here tonight by winning the Mid-Atlantic Championship. Your new champion, the Salty Dog, Joey Ace.